Hey, and good night. I am so excited to unbox my latest book that will be out um, in stores by next week. I know for sure it's in time for Easter and I'm excited about it. Hot cross buns for everyone. And I would like to share the unboxing of the book. I haven't seen the physical copy as yet, but I'll share this moment with everyone. <laughs> so I got this, my favorite UPS delivery guy. He, he was told about it, that it's coming and just to make sure and hold it for me because I'm going to get home from work a little late. So I got my books and I'm so happy. Um, thank you so much, Chalkworth, for sending this to me. So this is the paperback book. My Easter book. My Easter bunny book. See my bunny ears for the opening? This actually belongs to Miles, but he took my gray and pink and left me with the blue and white, which is just fine because it should match the book perfectly. <laughs> okay, let me get this out of the way. Oh, look at this. <laughs> okay, oh, I'll try to be normal. Hot cross buns for everyone. <laughs> look at this. Oh, look at the textures. You can see the flakes of flour. Daria Lavrova has brilliantly illustrated this book as she has with um, C is for Carnival and... Um, of course, we have hot cross buns and look forward to some more. But isn't this gorgeous? Isn't this so gorgeous? Kind of have the same feel as like Caesar Carnival that she did. But oh man. And look, they have the bunny ears. That's why I got mine. Oh, so hot cross buns for everyone. Jackson's friends and their families bake assorted hot cross buns for his Easter party. Liam's foster parents, oops, what's happening with my phone there? Liam's foster parents use his most memorable Scottish ingredient. And Dimitri's dad adds Greek Malipi spice. Some have rainbow colors for all to see and a sweet Jamaican bun and cheese recipe. Oh. One by one, the children arrive with hot cross buns for everyone. This is a multicultural Easter bug. Like, I've never had a multicultural Easter bug. And I'd like to, if you guys could comment and let me know if you ever had one. Like, and certainly not one with some Jamaican bun and cheese, which a lot of us in the Caribbean enjoy around Easter time. And I'm talking about that canned cheese, you know? A, a, little, a little extra pricey, but so worth it. <laughs> okay. I'm weird, I sniff books, so this is my book. This is my book, thank you so much. Oh, oh, fresh new pages, I love it. Oh, I wish it had like a scratch and sniff, you know? Oh, 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 the recipe, the recipe by Monique from nowyourcooking.ca. Look at this, this tastes like Jamaican bun and cheese, just round with the cross on it. And I was privileged to taste this actual bun you see in the photo. Look at the cheese, cheese goes so well with it. But I wish I can scratch and sniff that, right? So delicious, Monique. Thank you so much for your beautiful ingredients. Um, of course, you know, um, our books have recipes with chalkboard with chalkboard for uh, my Soka birthday party with jollof rice and steel pans. You get to make jollof rice. Uh, seeds for carnival, you learn to make roti, um, a piece of black cake for Santa, you learn to make our traditional Caribbean black cake. And um, for Sweet Sorrel Stand, which was adopted by Chalkboard, that's now traditionally published and it's releasing in time for summer. And that will have the sorrel, aka zopo, recipe in there. So we're learning the traditional stuff, right? It's all about food, celebration, togetherness, culture, just, oh everyone i love it i love it i love it okay okay let me go through this let me go through this okay okay <laughs> look look at this i can't show you guys too much you got to get your own copy 
Look at these kids. Look at these kids. <gasps> oh, so great. Beautiful quality paper. So nice. This, this is all about togetherness and celebration, and our kids deserve this. And I'm so happy to share this story and so blessed to have Chalkboard Publisher that we're a pleasure working with to making sure we deliver the best in representation and diverse literature. Um, and I'm happy to offer my son a Easter book. I didn't mean to film this video in my glasses. So I'm, you know, I was trying to look all nice and normal, you know, like just, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Hot cross buns for everyone, guys. Check it out. Check it out. It's a classic. It's us forever. And I'm so happy about this. I'm like so speechless. I keep staring at it. You know, when I get off of this video, I'm going to be like touching everything, and reading everything and sniffing my book. <laughs> Thanks.